what people are talking, like how people actually talk, and then dive into what they actually mean. Um, I, I go between... Today is just a regular evening after work. I'm relaxing right now. And then gonna do some productive stuff. I definitely took more time than I planned and I spent lots of money on the internet. Lunch time. I mean dinner time. Dinner is over. Did you guys hear about uh, this website called Snack Shout? Basically stuff that's sold in, um, on Amazon. Uh, they sell here at the big discount sometimes, like 60%, like this bike pump, $6.40. That's pretty cool. I'm gonna get one of these. So on Amazon, this thing actually 18 bucks on sale. So I go to buy it now, and then I go to promo code here. Insert the promo code. And now it's now it's 720 after taxes. That's pretty cool. Dinner is over, and you take a shower now. Wow, couldn't couldn't get off that my website snack shout. I bought probably 30 bucks worth of stuff by now, and it's nine o'clock already. Jeez Louise. Um. 9 o'clock is our prayer time. I'm going to read Bible and pray. Well, there you have it. Another day that was very unproductive. I hate to admit that, but some days are like that. I was supposed to relax for an hour or so after work and then be productive. I needed to edit the video for Mr. Gordon. I'm helping him with that documentary. So far I spent one hour doing it yesterday. And that's it. So today was, not, was supposed to be another day when I do that. And then and then I was supposed to do a vlog. As, as you can see, I haven't done that. So I basically spent some probably a couple hours uh, watching videos and then uh, on a snack shout I probably spent like 30 40 bucks by now <laughs> I don't know I was buying some cheap things for like five six ten bucks and and yeah that's not only not productive day but also day that I spend more money Definitely, that's not an ideal evening. Those are just some things I struggle with, unfortunately. But sorrow may last through the night, but joy comes in the morning. Tomorrow is a new day, and I hopefully get a chance to to have a better day. This morning, actually, I got up on time and. Instead of spending time with God, I got distracted by things and, and the phone. And basically my morning started that way. And lo and behold, and lo and behold, the evening is exactly the same way. <clears throat> so that definitely has an effect on me. How I spend my morning and what do I do. And unfortunately, that, it doesn't even feel like a relaxing evening. You know, when you plan to relax, that's different. Because you purposefully do it. But when you struggle all when you struggle all evening long with stuff that you need to do and you're doing stuff that you want to do, it end up being very unsatisfying day. One of the things I'm learning is not to dwell on my faults and my shortcomings, but actually be gracious and forgiving and instead of blaming myself for something 
work on improving that, work on eliminating the issue, work on avoiding that in the future. So, so yeah, <clears throat> I need to be more disciplined with my phone. Alright, my unproductive evening is over. We'll see you tomorrow, guys. And don't forget to live life intentionally and do a better job than I did today. This is Vladimir Nemchinov.